The main difference between the baker at your local pastry shop and the baker at a large manufacturing firm is the environment in which they work. A local baker is likely to interact with co-workers and customers and has a hands-on approach to the products. Manufacturing bakers spend more time with machines, turning out the large quantities of baked goods found in grocery stores and other establishments. They combine common sense, experience, and skill with their hands to troubleshoot on the job. As the industry becomes more automated, industrial bakers are called upon to watch dials and monitors, instead of personally observing the direct effects of their work on bakery products. But there's still nothing like a direct look to make sure that colors, shapes, and icing are all in order. While this is not a physically demanding job, there is a certain amount of bending, lifting, balancing, and stooping involved. Most workers spend a lot of time near hot ovens and must work evenings or weekends. It's often a noisy environment, too. Preparing batters and fillings requires the ability to measure and the knowledge to correctly operate scales and use graduated containers. As you move up in the business, you might need to learn more about how baked goods are made and distributed. For this reason, most manufacturing bakers need one to two years of vocational training or related on-the-job experience. The annual wages for this position are relatively low, and job growth is expected to be slower than average. But there are always opportunities for manufacturing bakers who come up with a great product and cook up a real success story.